Yo, what's up, y'all? This is Devin the Ripper, and you tuned in to What's the Motivation? My name is Devin the Ripper from Southern Maryland, raised in Clinton, grew up in Waldorf, and I'm a rapper, actor, entrepreneur, record label owner, Lee Mac Entertainment, LLC, activist, lover of people, lover of God, all of that. I first fell in love with music since birth, for real, for real. Um, you know, since my family was in music, music was just always there, you know. Um, so getting well acclimated with go-go music and, you know, my father's work and everything like that. But growing up, I was more so into hip hop. I remember coming home, watching Rap City in the basement. They had a throwback jam with Nas. Uh, it ain't hard to tell. That was my first time consciously listening to lyrics. And I was like, yo, this shit dope. So I went to the store, got the Illmatic CD, got the Infamous by Mob Deep, got a whole collection of classic albums, man. That's when I really started to dive in depth and into it. That was like around middle school. So ever since then, man, I always had a passion for it. Then I started rapping a few years ago, 2019, and I'm here. You know, I love it. Devin the Ripper, it came from, because I rip bars, I'm a lyricist, I put a lot of thought in the shit I got to say, and my first stage name was just Devin, because I just wanted to be myself, I didn't want to take on a name or just make some persona or nothing, I just wanted to be Devin. Devin translates as poet in Irish, and it translates as God, or God-like, or divine in French, and I'm like, that's something that perfectly describes me, so I'm gonna go with that, but... My first project was under Devin, and it was just hard to find just typing in Devin because a whole bunch of shit pop up on the DSPs when you do that. So I decided to switch it to Devin the Rapper for a couple days, and then I was just like, Devin the Rapper, Devin the Ripper. I was just like, I'm gonna go with Ripper. Because when people hear my shit, they gonna hear me rip shit. And that's how my career gonna go. I'm gonna rip through shit. DMV scene, man, treated me with love. Since I touched back down 2019 from LA, I've been on the grind, hustling, made some beautiful connections, man, um, some industry people, other artists, blogs, such as What's the Motivation. Everybody, man, they've been receiving me well. They really fuck with my music. And the reason I came back is because it was a renaissance going on in the DMV rap scene, the DMV music overall. A lot of artists from the area, they starting to get recognition, and I wanted to be a part of that. And I said, if I wanted to rap, I want my music to reflect the culture I come from. I ain't want it to reflect nothing else. I want to build up the DMV. I want us to have our own shine, our own reign, have our own run like a death row in the Rockefeller. I wanted to be a part of that. So y'all been embracing me and I love that. I've been acting since 2014. That's when I really got into the art. I was still at Bowie State. And then professionally, 2015, I got my first gig this movie called Live a Little, that's on Amazon right now. And uh, I took classes at Studio Theater on 14th Street. And that's where I really learned the arts, man. And I really studied theater. Like, not just acting classes, but I studied theater. So, it's been a beautiful journey, man. <laughs>